Arthur Broadson. Arthur, son of Broda, came from a human noble family in the capital of, of the Orans in Athera, Petrus. He was raised by Broda and Appa, his mother and father. In his early life, he was raised by a local source, uh, educated by a local swordsman named Aethred. He was one of the best swordsmen around. His educator, a good warrior, was an old scholar. So Arthur never had never had had never learned to do math, read, or count. Frankly, he was dumb as a rock. He was the oldest son of five, and by far the most hated up by his siblings and teachers at his school, mostly because he did not agree with the zealousness of being human. In their somewhat racist remarks about elves. Arthur had witnessed the genocide of the elves when the human king had died. His father had participated in the slaughter. This event made Arthur see the world in different light. It wasn't all sunshine and rainbows. When Arthur reached adulthood, he suffered a horrible loss. His mother, Appa, had died. In a, in a way, this was good. His mother had come from a wealthy noble family and left a hefty sum of, of mon money for her hair. Her heir. Her heir was Broda. Arthur, being a greedy man, plotted to kill his father to gain his mother's wealth. He was he and his co conspirators were Sail Sailred, Aethred, and Eldwine. His plan was for his father to be poisoned at a party that was coming up. The, his plan worked out, but Sailred backed out and at the last second and snitched and everyone knew that Arthur had killed his father. Arthur had, had still inherited his father's wealth and fled prosecution to, to the Isles of Valor. That is the history of Arthur Brewardson, son of Brewardson.